I should have stayed home and done my vlog at home today, but I really had an urge to go to the library. It is Wednesday, April 8th, 2009. Do you guys like going to the library? And either way, do you like reading? And what are you reading right now? I'm always reading too many books at once. I'm trying to finish up No Logo before I move to Minnesota. Cause it's Heidi's book. Oh, I'm gonna find it, I'm gonna find it. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna find it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna find it. Mm. I still don't have my picture with a cop, but there's some cop cars back there. I'll try to do that one for the rest of my life. So the rest of us don't have to be our alter egos? Yes, you do have to be your alter ego. Let's go knock over a 7-Eleven. Who knows what that's from? My favorite lollipop flavor is probably grape. And when I rewatched your vlog where you asked that, it reminded me that last night I had a dream that involved me having more of your orange and purple lollies, but not just two like you sent me. I had a bunch of them and someone else was wanting them. I was like, I guess. I guess you can have one. I mean, they're really good lollies that I can only get from Nikki. Nikki O. Nikki. Feel better soon. I am about five feet and seven inches in centimeters, that is. Sure you are. Hey, Bob. I know it wasn't a real dare, but I'm still wearing a hat. Don't think I can speak with an Australian accent. One day I will change my name to Katie MC Bindergarten. We most definitely have to show baby pictures before, so you're probably gonna see some of the same ones. You also just watch that video. This one, and there's this one. Not really a baby, but I'm pretty small. Baby. baby. See this one? Baby. Here's the freshest of all baby pictures. I am about five feet and seven inches. I have a question and a dare all in one. Can you do this and show if you can do it and try? If you can't or don't know. So I've hardly ever, ever, ever had times that I've actually written it in a journal or a diary or whatever, but <laughs> before I went to middle school, at a new school with a bunch of people I didn't know, I knew that one of the people in my class was from my town. Because lots of the people were from, shh, loud motorcycle. Anyway. I had to say something about that I hope that he was really cute or something like that. And probably when I'm back in Minnesota this summer, I could read the page directly from the real diary. I do have DDR and maybe I'll show you another time me doing it. Bob, was that you playing DDR? I mean, I know that was you, but were you playing DDR? Here are some nice gas prices. 231, 241, 249. Right off the tree. When I was way younger, sometime I was trying to make macaroni and cheese from a box, and I never drained the noodles, and then I was trying to mix in the other ingredients, and I made some macaroni and cheese soup. Also, Nikki, aka Aunt Dracula, and I stole a pizza from one of the dorm kitchens one time, and then we tried to go cook it in another dorm kitchen. <laughs> But the oven wasn't really working, so it just kind of got thawed out and mushy. And then we tried to bring it across campus to another dorm kitchen. And then I think it gooped down because it was too mushy already. And then smoke and bad things. I think I've had more cooking disasters than that, definitely. But that's enough for now. Who knows who made a cameo appearance? in my last vlog. Wow. I can't tell. Like think it might just be resting hands. Yeah. Everyone thought that they were holding hands, but I think it was just an optical illusion. Hi, Megan, on a kiss and Sam. 
Thanks for watching.